now, Jermaine, Ryan, and continuing on with using the new products from Rihanna by Fenty. Wait, is that all right? Using products, yeah, by Rihanna. It's the Fenty Hairliner Collection. And as... Mm, um, Okay, let's do that all over. Welcome, welcome, welcome to Jermaine on Natural. I am Jermaine Ryan. And continuing on with using the new products by Rihanna in the Fenty Hair Collection. So in the last video, and remember that any videos that pop up above will always be linked down below in the description box and sometimes in the end cards for you to check out after this one. So I started the things off a little bit differently. I can't remember why at this moment. But I started with styling first. So uh, in that video, you'll see the full review. I'll talk about the ingredients in that video. So going backwards and not actually going to record, because I even though I've used them, I actually did record with them. So, <laughs> so it's going to be fresh recordings. <laughs> um, but going in with the shampooing and conditioning products. So this time going with the Rich One, the Moisture Repair Shampoo and the Mini, because that's what I got, this little set with the Minis. And the Richer One, their Moisture Repair Deep Conditioner in the Mini. So like I mentioned, used them already once before, so I'll be using them again for the second time. Cool things with the Fenty products. Number one, the smell of them are all amazing. I, Fenty Hair Team, Riri, <laughs> I need this another thing, a body wash girl a cream because i know you got the creams i know you got the fenty beauty creams but this scent and a body wash and the cream uh roll on perfume cologne oh honey <laughs> i need the scent and more things because my goodness does it smell good and truly really one of the best learning products that i've ever smelled like top three all right, so we all know the routine. I am going to hop in a shower. I'll do maybe some voiceovers, uh, show you how the things work, and so then we'll talk about what they said, of course, what they did, of course, and if there was anything that I needed from them. All right, um, let's go get in the shower. The hair is, it's, oh, this is actually, I, I only refresh this hair once, but this is the same hair from the trip. <laughs> Hey, it me. Okay, I'm I'm in the place, <laughs> and I have wet the hair down. So now it is time to shampoo. Where is the bottle? It's short and it's a mini. I couldn't reach it. Uh, time to now shampoo and get the wash day with freshly freshed hair. So going in first with the Fenty hair. It is the Rich One Moisture Repair Shampoo. Uh, it's basic. Wet your hair, wash it, rinse it. Duh. <laughs> this scent is just amazing and to look at what the shampoo looks like creamy rich um pearlesque so look at that all right let's let's get it going
Okay, hair has been double cleansed. And here is how it is looking after two cleanses. The richer one, this is the Moisture Repair Deep Conditioner. Per the site, um, it says that after your shampoo with the rich one, richer, the rich one moisture repair shampoo, apply the damp hair focus, focusing on the mid shaft and ends. Break through to ensure even distribution. Rinse well. And then the pro tip is that if you have high, press, high porosity or very dry or damaged hair, use this as your go-to conditioner. And as a last step, rinse with cold water. This can help to boost the appearance and shine of smoothness. All right, hair, good, damp. Let's separate. All right, hair, good and separated. Let's go with the richer one. So as I said, I've used this one other time. So I got a good, maybe two to three more uses out of this. <laughs> and for consistency, well, this is about how much I'm gonna use for this first section. If I were going to compare this to a lotion, normal. It is straight up and down. So this is nice and creamy. Just creamy. <laughs> cream, shaboogie, wop, cream, shaboogie. seem to be it for my hair texture so i'm gonna do this section this part is still damp i'm gonna do it with sopping wet hair and see if it's a little easier okay wait wait <laughs> and i'm going to do same amount as before as close as possible
deconditioned with heat for 25 minutes. And uh, here is how the hair looks. So two things happening here. Uh, new length since getting the trim. So <laughs> uh, barely, barely scraping <laughs> my shoulders. Uh, yeah, we definitely cut off a good amount because if you look at any of my videos from the past year, my hair was definitely like touching. Uh, <laughs> it was, what was it doing? It was... <laughs> <laughs> it was so elegantly, so cutesily laid up against my shoulders, just resting. <laughs> that was back then. <laughs> Not so much anymore. <laughs> uh, but, you know, necessary. But here's how the hair looks after rinsing the richer one, moisture rich, the deep conditioner out. So, of course, let's talk about what each of the products said did and if there's anything that I need from them. Hey, it's me. Okay, coming back to close out the video with using the Fenty Hair, the Rich One Moisture Repair Shampoo and the Richer One Moisture Repair Deep Conditioner. So, per the website, it says that with the Rich One Moisture Repair Shampoo, it's going to gently cleanse, remove oil and product buildup. It's going to be non-stripping, smooth frizz, improves detangling, makes hair feel softer and silkier, color safe. Um, and then with the Power By the Replenic Core 5, it's going to repair split ends, reduce damage, and the Lux Warm Amber Floral Scent that complements any vibe. The scent is just out of this world. I can't talk about the scent enough. It is out of this world i mean i mean but now as far as everything else uh it definitely did get my hair clean you saw the first wash not a whole lot of suds really focused on the scalp you know that's all it's always do second wash a lot more suds got the hair clean my hair didn't feel stripped this it didn't have enough slip for my hair type so if i was gonna say i needed anything from it more whatever to make the improve the slip in this uh type multi textures of type 4 hair it was color safe it didn't do anything to the color of my hair non stripping did remove buildup scalp was clean so yeah um that's what i would need from it um other than that it did what this shampoo was supposed to do next Let's talk about the richer one, the moisturizing repair mask. So again, so it says that it is going to deeply moisturize nutrition, dry damage hair, softens, reduce frizz, improve shine, uh, instantly detangles, makes the hair feel softer and silkier, plump strands for thicker looking hair. Again, with their signature Replenicore 5, that's what's going to help with, re with this repairing split ends and reduce damage. And of course, the same amazing scent. <laughs> So off the rip, the very first thing that I'm going to need with this, uh, as you know, I was in the shower, I read to you the instructions on how to use it. That's very simply it. That's exactly it. It doesn't give any more instructions on how you can use it. Now, there's a few FAQ section that says, um, can I let this, how long should I let this sit in my hair? Make sure the Richer One Moisture Repair Deep Conditioner is evenly distributed throughout the hair before rinsing out. Can I leave, use this as a mask? Yes, leave it for a few extra minutes before you rinse it out. So, with the shower cap, uh, with heat, with heat for 10 minutes, with a shower cap for five minutes. Um. It doesn't give any real clear direction. And I think that depending on your hair texture and type, that's just gonna make a difference. Uh, outside of that, if you put it in and you rinse it out, you know, after uh, after an assumed, what, what, three to five minutes is like a standard rinse out conditioner. It's a rinse out conditioner at that point. I mean I guess. Uh, like if, <laughs> um, I don't know. It, Question mark, cause I'm pretty confused. I don't know, it's it's weird to me because it says it's a deep conditioner, but it's saying that you can just rinse it out at an unassumed time that you feel like you wanna rinse it out. I Trace. don't understand. Shut up. I haven't tried it that way. The first time I use it, I use it with heat because that's what I know to do with a deep conditioner in order for it to actually do the things it says it's gonna do. I'm gonna, you know, I still got some usage in. How much I got in here? I got about two uses. So the next time I use this, I'm just gonna use it like a rinse out conditioner. Three to five minutes with my shower cap, do my shower, and just see how it feels on my hair. You know, I'll come back with an update, but um, not really clear on directions on this. Uh, it says use it with damp hair. So 
as I always mention, uh, the back of my hair, back here, around my ears, those are my loose textures. I never judge products on that. I was able to, to fairly detangle with this on damp hair. The rest of my hair, absolutely not with damp hair. This, it, it didn't melt away anything. It didn't make it any easier, both finger detangling and with my Felicia Leatherwood. Once I added water and got it soaking wet, it helped, but melting, mm-mm. Mm -mm. It was, I've not had to struggle with detangling my hair in a long time. A lot of pulling, it just wasn't melting away. It, it didn't, it, it, I need this with more slip. <laughs> it needs significantly more slip. Maybe a looser, like looser curl area? Yeah, okay, sure. Texture? Mm -mm. At least not my experience. Not my experience at all, Precious. Um, so yeah, that would be the biggest thing that I would need outside of telling me how I'm supposed to use this other than put it in and rinse it out if it's a deep, deep conditioner. Uh, as far as how my hair felt after I rinsed it out, once I struggled through that detangling, my hair actually felt really, really good. Um, making the plan, uh, plump strands to look thicker and stronger, uh, feeling deeply moisturized. Absolutely not. I did that part really, my hair felt really, really good. And it looked good. The hair was clumping together like that part. It did do, but my goodness, was it hard getting there. <laughs> it was not easy to get to that point. And like I said, I deep conditioned for 25 minutes with heat. You know, I just did what I normally do with other deep conditioners. Mm, I don't know. I, I think... The detangling part is a big deal for me because that's where I detangle. That's where I mainly detangle my hair. That's a big deal for me. And this just, it just didn't do it. It just did not do it well for my hair on damp or soaking wet hair. I'm kind of laying it in thick, but it's been so long since I've had to struggle with detangling my hair. It's, it's foreign to me at this point. I'm stunned. I'm just stunned. Mm. But the smell is amazing. My hair did feel good after I rinsed it. It did feel deeply moisturized, like that part was good. But so all together between the two, they were okay. Um, you all know I love Bianca Renee. She's one of my favorites. Watched her video and I mean for her hair, you know, that's a loose curl. It did all, it was super good for her. Um, I did watch Sheree's video and, you know, same thing. She was like, shampoo did what the shampoo was going to do. Um, just okay. Just okay. I, just okay. But the scent. <laughs> so, yeah, let me know in the comments down below if you have tried uh, either the Rich One shampoo and or the Richer One deep conditioner. Did they do everything for you that they said that they were going to do? Please, please let me know. I... Specifically with this and detangling, let me know if you've used it, how it worked for you. Damp hair and wet hair, like give me all the deeds. Finger detangle, tool detangle. Let me know if you have textured, kinky, coily hair. Um, let me know how it works. Uh, okay, all right. So yeah, make sure that you like this video. Feel free to share this out because somebody else with texture here may be interested in wondering how it works, even though there are a lot of videos on it already. Um, make sure that you click the red subscribe button. There are a few more things that are coming from the Fit to Hair Care line. <laughs> Punch the notification bell so that you can stay abreast of when I post my videos. And again, thank you for tuning in to Jermaine on Natural. I'll see you in the next one.